major break in the search for a serial killer. Accused of the most brutal crime. He had raped and killed over 100 black women. How did she survive when so many didn't? To this day, I have PTSD and that van experience. Young women are being snatched off of streets. Why did she get in the van? That's not real. There was a big chain on it in the lock. A demon is murdering innocent young women. I was so terrified. But there's one thing her kidnapper didn't know. Thank God! My uncles in Quiet Storm taught me how to fight. Freya Gibbs, the most dangerous woman in the world. The first African-American female kickboxing world champion. Oh, right. Then he said, oh, so you one of them fighting ones. He messed with a wrong woman. I stepped on his chest and I grabbed his d And I said, where the keys at, motherfucker? My mom used to say to me, you got it in you, you just don't know it. Somebody gonna have to wake it up. Woo, 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 running real fast into my mom's house. She was sitting down playing cards. I ran in the door, bam, all the cards flew. And that's when my mom said, girl, what the hell wrong with you busting in my door like a black superwoman? You done lost your mind. It was the whole school bus. The, the bullies were going to get me this day, and that was it. They had plans. They, they were going to get me. They told me to my face. Everybody got off the bus. All the kids got off the bus. I was so terrified, but one thing that I knew that I had, I knew how to run fast. But it was too late. The whole school bus was in front of my whole pad. I couldn't believe it, but I felt safe until my mom decided to go outside to find out what the hell is going on. Who want to fight my daughter? These girls raised their hand. Which one is the baddest one? Girl raised her hand, boom. Sissy, get out here right now. You're going to beat her ass. You straight up, you're going to beat that ass. And I'm going to give you this broom. And I'm going to tell you this here. You don't beat that ass, I'm going to beat your ass so you're going to get two ass with this. You got it in you. You just don't know it. She probably won that fight, though she can't remember. All she remembers is that she got back inside with a broken broom and that her mom didn't beat her ass. I didn't want to go back to that school. I was done of even walking that way. I was just done. I, I didn't want to go there anymore. I even considered committing suicide because I was done with these fools. Her uncle came to walk her home from school once. She didn't mind because he was a martial arts teacher, but he wasn't there to kick some kid's ass. He said, you can't continue running all your life, really. He said, so you're going to come to karate school and we're going to, I was like, no, 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 no. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. He said, this is not about fighting. This is about us rebuilding your self-confidence. So here I am at Quiet Storm Martial Arts School, one of the baddest, lethal martial arts school in Pennsylvania. The fun thing is, every Saturday, my uncle and I used to always get together for one hour. And what he would do, he'd take the keys. he locked the door, he put the key down behind him. He said, now here's the deal, you, once you get past me and get the key and leave, that's how you earn your black belt. He said, but you got to get past me every Saturday to have me fight him to get the key. For years, him and I, we fought, boom, 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 there many times I would get close to the door, you know, to get the key and he pushed me back, you know, and I get close, 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 and push me back. And I would always think about that, you know, when I got home, yeah, I got that close to that key, I can get that baby. I know I can, I know I can. So I'll never forget that day when him and I, we went at it. Boom, 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 boom. I got the key, opened the door, and walked out. I'll never forget him saying, now you've earned your black belt. Once I got that key, I was always getting the key. He couldn't beat me anymore. As her skills got more and more advanced, she began competing in tournaments. For the first time in her life, she felt in control. And she loved it. But just as she was starting to gain some confidence, a wolf was waiting for her right around the corner. That was in 1993. These uh, girls had invited me to a domino game. So I go on down, we play dominoes around all these people that I don't know. They're constantly giving me drinks left and forth, left and forth, but I don't drink. You know, I just wanted to go home. I had no idea that I was gonna be there this late. So dude says, I'll take you home. I took the ride, I get in, you know, and I'll never forget when he shut the door. The sound of the door is what got me. The way it was shut, I heard something. He gets in, and we're driving along, and I say turn right, and he turns left. 
I said, yo, bro, you're going the wrong way. Uh, he didn't say nothing. As she grabbed for the door handle, she noticed for the first time there was none. This guy had something planned in his head, and she was trapped with him. We get to this area. He's like, now let me just sneak it in, then I'll take you home. And I said, no, and I was going around, no, absolutely not. And he says, let me stick it in, no, 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 And then he went to swing, boom, and I blocked it, and hit, and ran to the back of the van. And, and, and that's when I realized there was a big chain on it in the lock. Then he said, oh, so you one of them fighting ones. I said, where's the keys at? It's one thing getting the key from my uncle, but it's another thing getting the key from somebody who's trying to then he came at me, he tried to tackle me, and I grabbed him in his shirt tail, <laughs> swung him back, pulled him down over his pants, I stepped on his chest and I grabbed his d And I said, where the keys at, mother Now mind you, I had his jewels up, I didn't even know they could stretch that high. He was yelling. He said, they're in my pocket. I said, which one? I grabbed him, I pulled him all the way to the door, I unlocked the door, and I wouldn't let him go. He was saying, let me out, he's let me go, let me go, let me go. No, I'm not gonna let go of this shit, I'm not letting go. I unlocked the door, and I said, listen, when a b says no, she means no. And I walked him, bam, then I left. And I had the keys, and I tossed them. That way he couldn't catch me. She didn't know it yet, but the man would later be arrested and identified as the grim sleeper. Major break in the search for a serial killer. He's accused of the most brutal crimes, at least 10 victims over a 25-year period. I called my mom, I called, and I told them this freaking guy just tried to he tried to rape me. I said, I want to get out of here. I was done in California. So they got me on the next plane out. My family was at the airport, and I told them everything that happened. They said, just forget about it. You know, it was a fight, just forget about it. Then suddenly, through this hell, I get a phone call to fight for the world title. I was terrified. I was never coming back to California again. What do I do? And they say to me, you're going to fight the most dangerous woman in the world. The most dangerous woman in the world? She must be tough. So I had to go to my mom. So they want me to fight the most dangerous woman in the world. My mom said, how the hell can she be the most dangerous woman in the world when I am? You go out there and tell her I said that you're the one that her mama warned her about. And she gave me a hug, saying to me, you are a star. And your job is to let the world know that you're a star. Press conference time come. Here comes the most dangerous woman around. She was looking fly. So she comes up to me, she says, I looked on the map and I couldn't find Chester. And then everybody started laughing. They was flipping. I just stepped forward to her. I said, you know what? Not only will you find Chester on the map at night, but I want you to know that I'm the one your mama warned you about. Here I am walking out to the arena, and I'm just keeping my eyes on the ring. I just kept my eyes on the ring. This one boy say, that's the black girl who came here to get knocked out. And I said, tonight, we are going to shock the world. First round, bam, bam, bam. I gave a little something, let her know, you know, hey, look, not tonight. Second round, she busts me up. Third round, we going at bam, bam, bam. And I'll never forget this as long as I live. My legs was getting tired. And I saw myself fall. So I had to reach within me, ask for help. Father, my legs are getting tired, help me. When I said that, boom! You know that sound? Bam! She spit again. Bam! Just like that, and it was over. The second the bell rang, a picture was taken, freezing forever in time, her victory. The referee of the event, he said, when Muhammad Ali knocked out Sonny Liston, that's the magnitude of this picture. He said, when I raised your hand, I have never heard a roar that powerful before in my life. But what hit Fridia when she saw it was the clock on the wall. That's when she realized she had done something really special. Looked up, A16, my mama's birthday. I had no clue how she was showing me how to use my powers. Because that's what a lot of us tend to forget, that we carry certain powers. My mom used to say to me, you got it in you, you just don't know it. Somebody gonna have to wake it up. The 
this is what this life is all about. Winning, leaving this place with our hands raised because we all have a race to win. Cause life is full of challenges and I won't let nothing stop me now. I will be out there plungering hard and how. A superstar I intend to be, Freedy of the Cheetah Gibbs is what the world shall call me. Cause world ain't no stopping me now. I have many plans and how. There are too many forks in the roads and problems I must bear, but with the will to make it my strength can't be compared. It is like I once said before, with a smile on my face. Ain't no stopping me now, world, cause I intend to win my race.